What a surprise, Valhalla's opening date has been delayed again for about the 69th time. Um, well, I say delayed, uh, let me explain. I just thought I'd do this quick video to explain what on earth is going on because I don't know, some people might be confused and I want to clarify a few things before you get there to Pleasure Beach this weekend if you are going. So, originally back in March they announced that technical rehearsals would be commencing after the 7th of April. So, for those who don't know what a technical rehearsal is, it's where the ride would be open for maybe a couple of hours a day, half an hour a day, possibly all day from that point, who knows, with some effects not working or not turned on because they're not ready yet. So it's almost like a soft opening, basically the same thing if you've ever heard that term. So it was never set in stone that this was going to be opening from the 7th of April, but uh, lots of people took that and thought, you know what, we'll make a trip to Pleasure Beach, you know, that weekend's the Easter weekend, which would have been a brilliant time to have opened it, by the way, because the park is really busy, so would have been a good boost in reputation for them advertising the new ride. However, they've announced today on the 6th of April with one day notice before everyone was hopefully trekking up to Blackpool to get on this thing that there's six days to go, as you can see on the screen now, this tweet on Twitter. Like, why? I just don't understand it. You've probably seen on social media that everyone's going to be making their way up to um, the park this weekend in hope of getting on it. There's been radio silence ever since that announcement. Honestly, it feels like 2022 again, and I thought we were over this, because in terms of winter, the social media's been really good. But yeah, absolutely nothing until today. In fact, even Amanda Thompson tweeted yesterday that she didn't even know when the ride was going to be opening. And she runs the place like, it's just a bit of a mess, really. Uh, I am going to be at the park tomorrow, and I am going to be filming something. Uh, Josh is also going to be with me from Theme Park Mad, who I'm sure you've seen on the channel many a times. Uh, he's cancelled other commitments to make his way up there, so he's not best pleased either. Uh, neither am I, even though we are season pass holders. Like, imagine, does people travel from Scotland to get on this thing? So yeah, basically it's been confirmed now that Valhalla's not going to be opening any time this weekend. It's going to be opening next Wednesday, which when I'm actually... Uh, Book to go to Alton Towers, so that's going to be really, really annoying. Currently, it's obviously Easter holidays, so I can pretty much go any time to ride this ride. But the one day I'm doing something else is the day that they announce with six days' notice that it's going to be opening. I've not looked much at Twitter and stuff because I pretty much jumped on to make this video as soon as I saw it. It's only just come out, and yeah, it's really annoying. I don't know why or who has made this decision, but. It just doesn't make sense to me whatsoever. So yeah, if you're going on the 12th of April to ride Valhalla, let me know how you get on. I will be going as soon as possible to ride it. Uh, thankfully, obviously, being a local season pass holder, I should be able to get there that weekend or something like that to have my first say on it, providing they actually it is open with the, the technical rehearsals. I don't know. They might decide not to open it on the weekend for some reason. Goodness knows, because anything seems like a possibility at this stage. Yeah, hopefully I get on it very soon. I'll be obviously re releasing a full review to let you know what I think. This has been completely off script because I want to get this out as quickly as possible to clarify everything that's going on. Click the icon in the centre of your screen to subscribe to Thrillnet for more things thrill related in the UK and beyond via the internet. And click the video on the right side of your screen to find out how we got on on opening day at Blackpool Pleasure Beach. Thank you and goodbye. I'm out.